hello so today we're going to talk about the one thing that i am obsessed with besides makeup and food hair care products oh yeah we're all excited so i got the pro salon box which come in looks like this so what come in it was a conditioner which is wella i don't know if i'm saying that right but it's a conditioner full size and the shampoo which this is all for like color protected hair and this is a salon products full size now and the other things that come in here were actual coloring of course it's blonde which my rear end is not ever ever gonna try to dye my hair blonde that's that's a whole new set of problems but it comes the developer and both things i think i'm gonna try to use this on my mom my mom's blonde as we all know so that's what came in that so i can't wait to use these things shampoo and conditioner okay let's keep a count i have these which is a shampoo and conditioner now the other set i have is the ridkin ridkin i think that's how you say it uh frizz dismiss sulfate free these are the big the big bottles um i wasn't actually going to purchase these until uh, i went to the salon walked by walmart and there was a clearance thing and they said oh you buy one get two free what's that like that's act that's basically saying here here's some crack for free um i got those two and plus i got the this is the deep conditioning mask. It's the same type of thing. I have an obsession with these. I deep condition my hair every time I wash it, which I wash my hair two to three times a week. I try not to wash it all the time just because I know the oils and stuff is its natural food to try to make it look, you know, better. Um, the, one condi the one deep conditioner I don't use when I use the expensive ones is this is the one I do in between like that. And it is the Garnet Fruity Smooth Treatment One Minute. I like this. I use that today. The other shampoo and conditioner I have, <laughs> which is another Redken. I like Redken. Uh, is the Color Extend. Love it. Wonderful. I also like the Diamond Oil. Even better. Wonderful. And then, and that come in a set. Which come with the little Redken. I have Vinegar Rinse. Okay. Uh, don't smell like vinegar, thank God and Greyhound. Um, I've tried it. Uh, I mean, it does make your hair feel nice, I guess. I don't know. I, 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 that's probably all on my mind. Yeah, well, you know, it come in a set. I had to use it, so there you go. Let's see. The other things I have are I'm obsessed with the leave-in conditioners, okay? My hair is thick I'm not going to say coarse um it's it's damaged I guess because I, I color it all the time I used to color it myself now I go and get it done um so it, it's used to have a product in it. but as far as coarse and just burnt and damaged looking it's not uh but it is very thick I have what you call Texas pageant hair these curls that are in here today, they'll be in here till Sunday if I didn't want, and that's just how it works. Um, and by the way, I used a wand for once in my lifetime, and that was, you know, you know, nine degree uh, burns everywhere, but, you know, hey, my hands look like, you know, something horrible. I have at least three of the same hairspray. <laughs> <laughs> they're little bottles it's just the triple take 32 ridkin um this one come in the set um this is probably my favorite um hairspray of all um i do like the l'oreal in the gold uh bottle uh it when you spray it it does not feel it don't feel coarse like hairspray it don't even feel like you have anything in it. It's wonderful. It's like $15 a bottle. So, you know, I don't buy that regularly. Um, leave-in conditioners. Bam. Bam. Uh, Shazam. 
uh yeah we have another one and little bitty baby bottle so this one right here is i can't say that to save my life maybe you all can see it um don't despair repair strengths and moisturize leave-in mask i love it i use it every now and then uh this one i got when i got the fun the fun fit fab box uh this come in it and i use this when it i use this more when it was like summery out when it was summer summery <laughs> summer and like today when it's like rainy and nasty and humidity and all that because this will not make my hair uh turn into a massive um cotton ball because it yes that has happened and it's terrible love that stuff i've almost almost finished that bottle up i'm actually kind of excited um this one i use when i mean i picked it up this is that swartz i don't know you know that weird name um repair ultimate and i do like this has got keratin in it uh makes your hair real smooth and nice i love this stuff too i use this and then um i don't know if anybody sees me on facebook i use the shampoo and conditioner the cake uh which i think is a sister brand to the mark anthony am i saying that you probably I, I, I think it is um the shampoo and conditioner i used up uh it does make your hair smell like cake i love that shampoo um, if I don't have the high-end shampoos, I'll use that. I'll use, like, I always go, I never stay with the same shampoo all the time. I'm constantly changing it because I feel like my hair, it, my hair gets, my hair would get used to stuff. So, I just constantly change it to keep it. That's just me. It probably has no scientific fact, but, hey, it makes, it, I, I think it does. Uh, this leave-in conditioner uh, is wonderful. It smells like cake. Um, I will re-get this. I'll get the cake uh, shampoo again. I do like it. And then I got this in a box. Um, when I use this kind of stuff, the leave-in, you dab. When I say you put in a dab, you put in like, mm, boom. And all you do... What I do is do my hands like this. You don't rub it in. Oh, that was like I put it in lotion. But like that, and you just put it in. I never put it up here because if you want to look like you come straight out of a grease pit, there you go. Don't I don't ever put it up here. I put it down here, and then I'll take my brush and do it, and it puts enough. Um, the one thing I did get from uh, the salon when I did get my hair done was this is like cuticle polish which is like a smoothing cream it's at pureology uh this stuff is expensive but i use when i say just a dab and it really does keep me from having just horrible frayed out looking hair it really does it it's really nice granted i don't know if i'm going to pay you know 26 27 dollars all the time um I got the uh, the serum the shine serum with it it's like an oil um my hair gets greasy very fast i don't use this a lot um if you people see me on a day you know when you all see me i have my hair in a kink which it naturally does i will take this rub it in my hair and try to make it not look so dry um I put this in today, just a dab to make it look shiny. This and the cuticle come in a set. Um, I do like the Pureology stuff. I've never used the shampoo. I probably need to do that. Um, when it comes to mousse, these are the mousses I use. Um, this is the Mark Anthony Curl. Um, I don't use this one as much as I do the L'Oreal. Um, this feels like it's still, it's, it feels like you've got product in your hair. It really does. I mean, it gives it like a tacky. No, no. The L'Oreal air dry stuff, wonderful. Love this stuff. This is probably my third bottle of this. Um, I repurchase this every time. It's about out now. I absolutely love this mousse. Um, dry shampoos. My favorite one is Dove, if you're wanting to go on the cheaper side. Uh, Dove, that Batista, that Batista stuff, I mean, I like it, but the Dove is probably my favorite. I go through dry shampoo a lot because, like I said, 
my hair gets greasy very quick. Um, I did get the uh, Amica, Am, Am, Amica, I don't know. You'll learn real quick. I can't, I can't say nothing. Um, this stuff is wonderful and it does give you volume. Uh, I use this when I'm going out <laughs> more to make this, you know, I, I don't, I sparingly use this. And then the stuff that I do for flat iron, when I do flat iron my hair, um, the sexy hair hot, um, I do like the catwalk stuff. The thing I have with these, I have noticed if, and I can be spraying it way out here, you know, and it fall out, makes my hair look so stringy. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. You know, I know if you do it right here, it's going to look that way because you got it right on your hair. But I'm doing it way out up in here, you know. It does protect your hair. I don't use this too much because of that. I mean, it's this, I've had this bottle, I can't, I can't begin to tell you how long. Um, and it's still technically full. Um, I just kind of flat iron my hair without using stuff because my leave-in conditioners... 90% uh, of all my leave-in conditioners have heat protectant in it. So, um, that's kind of my hair, I guess, obsession, uh, collection. <laughs> um, I do, like I said, I, I wash my hair probably two to three times a week. Um, yes, I go through the big ordeal of shampoo and condition, putting in the mask, uh, and while the mask is set, and that's when I set and use soap and do all, you know, shave and do all the other stuff. Um, but yeah, and I, I will get this box again. Uh, I get it every other month, so I won't get it in March. I'll get it in April. So, and hopefully when I get it, it'll have a, um, like a hairspray or something in it. I mean, if they keep sending me color, that's great. Um, because they are, it is salon color. Um. So, I mean, if you have any questions about hair, I am not a hairstylist. I do not have a cosmetology degree. It is just clearly an obsession. Yep. Uh, you see me in the hair care aisle. If you see me out, by all means, tell me something and I will go by it because, hey, you know, that, that's, that, that's my thing. That and makeup. I think hair care is probably more my obsession the makeup so until next time guys see ya